Hello everyone, in today's video we are going to show you how to prepare a hair oil for dandruff related problems. We have already prepared few herbal hair oils but those hair oils are mainly to treat all the hair related problems and scalp related problems. But some of our subscribers and friends has requested us to prepare a hair oil in order to treat specific hair related problems. So we are preparing this hair oil mainly to treat dandruff related problems and scalp related problems. Of course you are all aware that dandruff causes itchy scalp and tremendous hair fall. So by keeping your scalp free from dandruff you can stop hair loss and also you can be free from itchy scalp. So by stopping the hair loss you can also promote the hair growth. So let's see how to prepare this hair oil and the ingredients required are aloe vera gel, neem leaves, I have taken the fresh neem leaves, fenugreek seeds, tulsi leaves, pepper, sesame oil, coconut oil. So you can use either orange peel or lemon peel. So you have to use any one of these peels. To prepare the anti-dandruff oil, I have taken a kadai. Let's ignite the stuff because I have some water droplets here. I just want that to vanish before I add oil to it. I'm adding 250 ml of sesame oil which is one cup and I'm adding around another 250 ml of coconut oil around one cup this is a half a cup measurement so I'm taking two cups of this so this is 125 ml so one cup of one so I'm going to have one cup So this is 250 ml of sesame seed oil and 250 ml of coconut oil in this one and now the stove is in low flame. So the oil is little hot when you keep your um, arms over the oil like this you can feel the heat here so it's pretty hot now. So at this time you can really add the fenugreek seeds. This is one fourth cup of fenugreek seeds. Keep the stove in low flame, that's very important. I'm taking a bunch of neem leaves and breaking it down like that. And be careful when you put it because it might tend to throw up some oil. So you have to be careful. So. Now I'm taking a bunch of tulsi leaves. This is one eighth cup of pepper. So I'm adding one eighth cup of pepper to this oil. Make sure the stove is in low flame. This is one fourth cup of aloe vera gel. Made this into small pieces. So I'm adding the aloe vera gel. You can find that these bubbles which get formed in this oil is just going down. But you have to make sure that the stove is in a very very low flame. Because the idea is not to burn anything. You can really find that the foam which has got formed in the oil when we put all these ingredients has gone. And now you can find that the oil in green color here this way. So the stove is in a very low flame. So after this we can strain all these leaves and we can use this hair oil for anti-dandruff treatment. Also at this stage you add some orange zest to it. You can also use lemon zest. I have just really taken a little bit of um, orange zest. Around a half orange. 
you'll be having a very nice fragrance when you add the orange zest to this oil you have to wait till the foam goes down you can find the oil turning into green color at this stage you can really see that the foam has really gone down to a greater extent and you can switch off the stove by now and allow it to cool down after that you can strain the oil and store it in a container so i am just going to allow this to cool down so by now this oil is cold and now you can really see that uh, being in uh, green in color so all these residues has come out separately as we haven't used any kind of powders or any too small substance i am going to take a filter like this otherwise if if you have used any powder forms or anything like that you have to use cloth as i haven't used any of that kind i'm using a filter like this to filter this oil i want it to be a little safe so i'm just taking a spoon to transfer this You can store the oil in a clean dry glass container. So you can use this hair oil once or twice in a week. You have to leave this oil at least an hour before you go for a hair wash. You have to apply lavishly on your scalp and hair and leave it to soak in your head for at least 1 hour and then wash it off. This hair oil would really give you very good results in get rid of dandruff and also helps you to get rid of any kind of fungal or bacterial formation in your scalp because of dirt and pollution and dandruff. It leaves it clean and conditioned so that helps to stop the hair loss and grow your hair faster and longer. This hair oil helps you to keep the scalp free from any kind of dandruff and infections. Do try this hair oil at home and share your feedbacks and comments with us. If you really like this oil preparation, please hit on the like button and do follow us in Facebook and Twitter. Please subscribe to our channel for more updates and thank you so much for watching this video. Stay beautiful. Bye bye.